Welcome to day 14 in your Building Strength for Life program. So this is the end of the second week. So today we are doing something a little bit different. We're doing a rest and mindfulness session. Now this is a really short session. Rest is really, really important. As I said at the end of week number one, rest is important, recovery is important. And today we're gonna to be working on staying in the moment and being a little bit more mindful. So if you are not familiar with mindfulness or you've heard of it, but you're not quite sure what it means, it's all about just staying in the present, feeling the moment and doing that without judgment. Knowing that your mind may or may not wander off into certain different areas at any one point and just drawing yourself back to the present. We're gonna do that today and work on our body. So we're gonna be mindful about the movements that we're making, mindful about feeling our body, feeling the connection between different parts of our body as we head down to the mat. So the first thing we're gonna do is kneeling up onto the mat. I want you to draw your arms out into a Y. So fingertips out into a Y, head nice and neutral, shoulders relaxed. And I want you to really pull in your shoulder blades and your elbows together. Hold in that position, breathing, holding, feeling that tension, easing away through the upper back and moving back into that Y position, stretching out into the ends of your fingers. And again, drawing in, squeeze and hold, holding those muscles, easing out the tension, staying in the movement, feeling the feelings. How does that feel? Can you feel the tension ebbing away and back up into the Y. We're gonna go for one more time. Stretch out into those fingertips and back in. Staying nice and slow, not rushing through. Squeeze those elbows together, shoulder blades together. Margot wants to say hello. Squeeze it through and rest. Coming into an all fours position onto your mat and put my toes together and open up my heels and I'm gonna start to slowly ease back, rocking backwards and forwards very slowly, paying attention to how my body feels. I'm not gonna force anything here, just bringing my body back, sitting into the space created by my heels and then walking those fingertips forwards. Dropping my head down and breathing, staying in the moment, I'm not thinking about other things I need to do, staying present, feeling the tension through the shoulders, pushing back into the heels just slightly, holding that head down, focusing on me, and you focus on you. Inch those fingertips forwards. Really feel that stretch. If you find that your mind is starting to wander away from what you're doing now, just bring it back. Coming back up into that all fours position. Rock backwards and forwards. Up and one more time back into that space created by the heels. Walk those fingertips forwards. You're not thinking about how fast, how far. You're staying where you are right now. In through the nose and out through the mouth. Holding into that position. Can you feel those muscles? Feel your arms. Know how your arms are connected into your shoulders. Feel how your shoulders are connected down into your back, through the ribs and into the hips, all the way down your spine. Coming back up slowly into your all fours position. Taking your time and moving into a seated position. Legs out to the side into a mermaid pose here. If you prefer, you can have your knees tucked under, closer together. But for me today, this is how I'm gonna sit. 
got one foot flat tucked into the other leg and the other foot flat against the back wall. I'm gonna reach up with the hand, fingertips up nice and high. I'm gonna arch over and feel the stretch through my side. Breathing in and out, holding that stretch. Coming back up and over. Not wondering about, I should feel more flexible, not wondering about what I should or shouldn't be doing. Staying in the moment and appreciating the fact that my body can move. Being mindful of what's working here through the sides. Over back to the other side. Just taking this little bit of time for you. Stretching helps to increase blood flow into those muscles. Those muscles that are a little bit sore after working out together for two weeks now. These exercises are really going to help to promote healing, recovery, and help you to make the changes that you're asking your body to make. Changing position with the legs when you're ready. If you want to hold a position for longer than I'm holding it, then feel free coming over to the side. Or similarly, if there's an exercise that doesn't feel right for you, you're being mindful of your body and it doesn't feel good. You can skip that exercise and do what is right. Over. Stretching through. Staying in the moment here. If you feel that mind wandering, don't get frustrated with yourself, no judgment. Draw yourself back to now. Notice what's happening in this moment here with your body. Start to imagine your skeleton beneath your skin here. What are those bones doing? How are the muscles joined? Last thing we're going to do is we're going to lie onto the mat. So lying back down, draw yourself down into a really comfortable position. Stretch yourself out. Take a deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth. And as you do that, one more time in through the nose, out through the mouth, and let your whole body relax. Starting at your toes, I want you to relax all the way up to your head, so paying particular attention, relax each toe one by one, working into the ball of your foot and the arch, through the heel and the ankle, breathing and relaxing, through the calves and the shins, relax to the knees. Relax above the knees all the way through the thighs, the quads and the hamstrings. Relax the hips, sink down into the mat. Relax the spine, vertebrae by vertebrae. Relax the ribs. Let your breath flow naturally as you come up into the chest and the shoulders. Relax the fingertips, hands, the thumbs. Relax the wrists and the forearms up to the elbows. Relax your upper arms back up to the shoulders. Finally to the neck, to the head. Relax your whole head jaw all the way around your head. 
stay in the moment. Think about what you want to think about. Push away any thoughts that you don't want to be there. Notice how your body feels. And you can relax for as long as you want to. This is your time now. This is your workout time. I'm going to end this session, but you stay there as long as you want to. Tomorrow is the beginning of a new week, a whole week's worth of opportunities ahead of you. It's a building power week and tomorrow's session will be a 20 minute session. I look forward to seeing you then. Take care. Bye.